What'd you do? What's up guys? It has been a minute since I pulled the camera out, but we are at our signage shop today picking up something kind of cool. So our white trailer that a lot of you guys will remember, we got a full wrap on it and this thing came out pretty freaking awesome. So I'm gonna hook this up real quick and we're gonna drag this thing back to the shop. hooked up lights are on it's about five o'clock right now and they closed at 4 30 so <laughs> i'm gonna have to come back tomorrow to pack hope they're not mad about that but it's supposed to snow tonight so i'm actually going up to the shop right now to put my plow on when i drove by i saw the trailer there and i said i really don't want to pick it up tomorrow and then get it covered in salt driving it back so i figured i would just take it tonight but let's hope they don't get mad at me all right, we just got back to the shop here, so let's take a quick walk around this thing. We got our services up front. We threw some nice photos on there. One thing I'm realizing right now, which pisses me off, this picture was taken before polysand was put in. So you can see those little stones in there. So I think I'm the only person that'll notice that, but that really bothers me. Um, <laughs> anyway, services again. Uh, I had them throw on Google five-star reviews and also the A-plus rating with the Better Business Bureau. Clearly big logo because we want people to know who we are. Uh, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, all that good stuff. Got to get this latch fixed. We, lo we locked this one day, lost the lock and pulled out the angle grinder. But on the back here, just big logo. Again, Google and the Better Business Bureau and then same side, same ordeal. So I'm pretty happy with it. I mean, I think it turns out awesome. Like I said, the only, the only thing I noticed, I'm walking by and I'm like, oh my God. Oh well. I don't know, maybe we can take a black marker or something and <laughs> scribble that in, but this looks pretty sick. So we got this other trailer back here. This is also identical to that one, same brand, same make. I think it might even be same year, but this guy's 20 foot. Um, but this one, we just did our logo and threw some small things on there. But honestly, I like this trailer. It's just, it's very clean. You see the logo, lawn and landscape. I don't know, I think it's nice. You can see we got a few dents and dings in this one because of some idiot employees but it is what it is i'm hoping that this other trailer isn't going to be nearly as beat up as that one the inside on that one the ramp's all torn up and it's rough so we're going to get this thing parked i'm going to throw my plow on and then i'm going to get out of here because it is chilly good morning guys quick fast forward here it is probably two weeks later not even maybe a week and a half later from when we first shot the video of that trailer but it's a gorgeous day today so I got Mike and Eli coming up. We're uh, gonna clean out the shop a little bit and pull that trailer in. And then I don't, I don't really know what we're gonna get done today to tell you the truth, but really just gonna go through, take inventory of everything, uh, figure out a plan, an organization plan, because last year that trailer was an absolute mess all year. So uh, maybe we'll take a trip to Curtis Lumber, get some wood to build some shelves and start that process. So we'll probably play you guys out when Mike and Eli get here. got a backup camera can't even get it straight go forward a little bit just pull out walk onto the road a little bit just go really slow uh, <laughs> meet you want me to do it oh, oh, okay <laughs> no oh, I'm back it in there That's fun. <laughs> you got plenty of room Put the ramp down and then I'll back it up with the ramp down. Back up more. Yeah, I know. I'm just looking. Back up more. Okay, okay, boss. I swear I'm gonna quit this job. Good. 
be good. I found a truck for you. Did he send it to you? It was a white, I think it was an 18 Platinum. Identical to his, diesel, 39 grand. Had like 200K, but. 39 grand for a plat, hey man. For a five year old truck? 200K? That's like. I'll tell him the white like, platinum I sent like, you. I have to like literally get it to the nope. like, The one, it was like 39 grand. Oh, I found a dually white uh, 29350 this morning for yeah. 45. Really? Yeah. Lariat? Uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you got a key. I can just. <laughs> I wish they didn't do the tree. I think it would have just been better with just mags. But whatever. We've never used that. Ever. Dude, you put 20 pounds in this. It's gonna break. Look at this. Yeah. Ben put it in here. He's like, oh, you can use it. For what? I don't know. I said put it in your trailer if you want to eat lunch. I'm like, who's gonna eat, who's gonna eat lunch in the trailer? <laughs> Chit-chat. Oh, chit-chat? Yeah. Eli, how's your day going? Yeah, I don't know. You're pretty good. <laughs> but you know, you know. Yeah, no, let's do this, bro. We're bored. I don't want to f***ing buy it. Just come to this chit-chat. Got ourselves a new mailbox, too. Look at that. Probably not going to last too long, though, after you guys see what we do to it. All right, we got the trailer in here. We got a good game plan set up for this. For the most part, we should be in pretty good shape. So instead of actually working on it today, we're gonna move over to the mailbox here. So we gotta get this thing installed, pour some concrete around it. Oh yeah, that is quality. Four by two. Oh my God, I'm should we just hit it? Should we build a box? Should we hit it with the cop car? <laughs> no, smash the windshield. <laughs> That'd be kind of funny. Dude, be careful. Yes, Spent a lot of money on this. No, stop. Look it up my directions. Got it. Why are there two? It's two oh, levels? Yeah. Oh, man. It's a nice one. Spent two much. That actually is nice because when I used to do flyers, I would have to hang them on the mailboxes and the mailman would always yell at me. Really? But this is nice. You could just slide it. They got a flyer section. No. Oh yeah. We, I mean, it would have worked, but. You know, yeah, go grab. <laughs> <laughs> Our next, <laughs> next name is right there. Just tap it lightly. Oh, money. Nice. <laughs> oh, mother. Are you kidding me? <laughs> Dude, what? Why does the back keep popping out? <laughs> Got it. <laughs> Build a mailbox. Well, they make it stupid. <laughs> Still got a little bit to go. Yeah, I know. What? Yes, you really want to start. Why? Yeah, because he turned the key on. Is it out of gas? I wonder if it's just, no, it's not cool, cold enough to gel. Oh, that again? Here, don't, don't keep trying it. What, did a code come up? The code's injector storm rail. That's the same code that it had when I bought it. Here, turn the key to on position. Okay. It comes up once it's running. Here. Call to him. Don't try it yet. Alright, try it. Alright, stop. That's weird. No code. No, the code just popped up when I was running. And I shut off. Yeah. It's an injector rail, right? Yeah, that's what it was before. When that, when that line was pinched. No, it's cat wrap out here, man. 
take a video of our Instagram, send it to Timmy. Here. What'd you do? Get the mechanics out here. Uh, oh! Oh! oh. Wait, wait. Is the code gonna pop up? Wait. Try and rev it up. It's probably cold. You let it warm up though, didn't you? Huh. Uh. Same thing it was doing before. Oh, Here, try and get it out. I think I've pushed enough dirt to it. You got it. <laughs> Not happening. You want to hook a chain from it to your truck and just. Yo, you're dead serious about doing this. Yeah, you're I am. You committed. I was going to just hook it, hook it uh, down. down. This is the only part that's like stuck. That'll come right out. Go nice and slow. It'll it should pop right out, I think. Oh uh, hopefully. <laughs> hopefully, we'll see. Hit it. <laughs> I just locked and everything. Man, this truck sucks. <laughs> Let me tie it up higher. Let's go really slow. Oh, ah, uh, keep going. Yeah, keep going. Keep going. Got it. Ah, uh, a little more. There you go. You're good. Back the truck though. Why'd you, why would you park it? Why'd you park it there? He's a idiot. You still need that middle pin, genius. Turn all the way to the right. Come back. Digger was a no go, so we're going with plan number hey, two. Careful, the doors are fragile. Oh, that's true. That's true. I paid good money for this 80 bucks on Amazon. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> fuck. They wasted 80 bucks. Nice, <laughs> dude. That's like, dude, that's, that's money. <laughs> money dude. Yo, let me get a shot of you walking over with like a piece of paper, put it in, and just like put it up. <laughs> no, I don't. Yeah, no, that'd be funny. Would it be? Yeah. Put something in the mail, put the thing up, and then another truck just comes in. Yeah. <laughs> you gotta edit it right if we do that. Yeah. I know. <laughs> All right. Perfect. Dude, that was good. That was good. <laughs> I put that in the perfect spot. <laughs> Again. Again. <laughs> Is it salvageable? Can I use it in my house? Yes. <laughs> Dude, honestly, like it's not bad. <laughs> we could rebuild it if we needed to. <laughs> Here, no, 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 I, I got it, I got it. Get it, get it. Oh my God. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, all right. You want to bring this by the post office to return it? Yeah, I got you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there you yeah, go. Yeah, we just we just didn't need it. <laughs> well, we, we I bought it. Ran out of ran out of places to eat. <laughs> <laughs> Homemade millops. All right. Money. Yo, yo, whoa! Be gentle. Come on, dude. I paid good money for that. <laughs> <laughs> Call Tim Milton Cat. 
Yeah, what the hell, Tim? <laughs> yeah. Yo, go pick up your crap. Come pick up. <laughs> shit. I'm bringing my cooler. Unreal. Unreal, Tim. No. Didn't even take the time of day. We're done. We're going to deer. Takeuchi, here we come. Takakuchi, whatever it's called. I'm kidding. Tim's great. Tim declined my call. He owes me a cat cooler, too. Kubota. Actually, yeah, Kubota. Kubota yeah. If we had a Kubota dealer, a good one around here, I would honestly seriously yeah, no, consider it. Because I, I love those skid steers. Because they're cheap. So they're, they're not cheap. They're expensive now, dude. I knew, I knew of uh, KX 557. Mm. Goodbye, everybody. You might not see me again. Ever again. That's a little. Are you okay? No. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. We get it. We get it. Oh, see. <laughs>